Hello friends and strangers, I am Heli and in this video I am taking you with me into Story of Seasons, Pioneers of Olive Town. We have a super cute baby alpaca. You are going to be Arlo. Arlo the alpaca. So cute. It is day 16 of spring. And no birthdays today. It's a sunny day, so let's find Snowdrop and take her for a walk. Good morning, darling. Let's go for a walk. We have a lot to do today. We need to go to the museum, there's a garlic harvest, and we need to turn in the, uh, the cloth for the quest. Tough cloth, was it? Yes. And on top of that, we, of course, need to do all of our usual farm chores. It may be that we don't have time to go visit Ludus today. But that's fine. We'll go see him whenever we have the time. Maybe give him some better gifts. Here you go, Karina. Maybe one of those jewelry things that say they are guaranteed to be received well. An old boot. Okanite, another thing to be sold. Desert rose, I'll sell that too. Gold ingot. That I'm not going to sell. Bronze town metal. Lots of things to be sold in these ones today. Jewelry locket. Something we could give to Ludus. Supple lumber. Alright. That hunt was no yolk, get it? Because eggs? Uh, everyone pitched in to make the egg hunt a resounding success. Splendid! I guess the yolk was supposed to mean joke. I wonder if the egg hunt is a tradition passed down from ancient times. 
could be, possibly not in quite that form that it is in today, but it is possible, probable, that ancient cultures may have appreciated eggs as a source of life. Welcome! If you're here for Jack, he's out right now. Hey Jack! Heather, did you come all this way just to look for me? Well, since you went to all that effort, I guess I should reward you with a present. I call it the Welcome to Olive Town yo-yo. I made a mountain of these things thinking I could make our town famous for them, but... Cindy told me no one in their right mind would want to buy it, let alone take it for free. Ah, I ended up yelling at her for it and, well, here I am. But looking back on it now, I guess I was the one at fault. I gotta go back and apologize to her. That's very responsible of you. There you are. Cindy's in the back. Make sure you apologize properly. You're the adult here. Cindy, hey, I'm sorry for yelling at you. Please don't be mad. I'll buy you anything you want. Oh yeah, bribery will get you everywhere with children. Oh, uh, hey, sorry. About earlier, I mean. I shouldn't have yelled at you. Give me a snow globe. Huh? Is that all you want? Give me more. More? Wait a minute. Where are you going? To Mikey's place? The beach. Ah. What? She's going to throw them into the ocean. My big bro's a big idiot. What? I... I mean, if this is what makes you feel better. Idiot. Wait, you're still going? Stupid. Ah. Uh. You still have the one my brother gave you before, right? Give it. You're gonna throw that one too? Uh, I like snow globes. I'm keeping it. Phew, I was on pins and needles there. <laughs> Well, at last Cindy got to do what she wanted. Try out the thing yeah. she's seen on TV where people who've been disappointed by men or boys throw the um, snow globes into the ocean. The snow globes that the men or boys have given them. The egg hunt is almost like one big picnic. It's fun. <laughs> the egg hunt was simply exhilarating, wasn't it? <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. 
Uh, that's fine. A couple of bad puns related to eggs won't ruin my day. So, for today's request, we need to bring one solid lumber. Let's do that. And for now, we'll put the locket in here. But perhaps someday we'll give it to Ludus to advance our friendship with him. We can sell the metals and the uh, desert rose and okenite. And let's go and take the solid lumber to town hall. There you go, Dosetsu. It is almost noon, but let's drop by the flower shop. Welcome. Did you come to buy flowers? Or are you here for Lynn? If you are, you'll have better luck going out to find her. If you stay and wait for her to come back, you might be a while. She's been drowsy all day. She said she needed to go out and get some fresh air. I'm certain she's taking a nap somewhere. Heather? That's right, I need to get back to the store. Oh, but I can't. Please let me sleep a while longer. Yesterday I got a letter from my friend in the city. Well, actually it was more like a package. She sent back some books I'd lent her a long time ago. I started reading them, but I got so absorbed in them that I couldn't stop. I miss my friends so much. I wonder what they're all up to these days. I do find Olive Town a fun place to live, but to be honest, I feel like I can't get comfortable here. At this rate, I won't know anymore where it is that I truly belong. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to drag you into my personal worries. But what about you? You seem to have gotten used to life here, Heather. I need to make an effort to be like you in that regard. No, I'm back. Oh ho, you've finally returned. I'm so sorry I'm late. I can run the store now. Thanks. 
by the by, looks like something arrived for you. What is it? Seems to be the rest of the books you lent out. There are a lot more than the last package. What? No, I'm going to end up reading all of them again. No, oh, pull in. Oh, are you guys closed on Mondays? You have to enjoy little shake-ups to your daily routine as they come. It's the little things in life. Yeah. Looks like they are closed on Mondays. All right. We'll have to come and check the flower selection tomorrow. Thank you for the right moonbeam. Now, let's look after our animals. Hello, Buttercup. Clover. Sunflower. Hairbell. Thank you so much for the eggs. Please come on out and enjoy the sunny day. Let's make some mayo. Don't need to save these for anything, so we'll just make mayo out of all of them. Hello, Ginseng. Olive. Zinnia. Cornflower. Petunia. Lily. Thank you all so much for the milk. Come on out into this beautiful day. Let's process the milk. see our wool animals. Hello Willow. Fern. Ophelia. Oh. Meant to pet Ash there. Hello, Ash. Daisy. And would you kindly stop moving? Hello, Aloe. Welcome to the family. Thank you all so much for the wool and fur. Hope you enjoy that beautiful day. Oh.
Oh yes, we have enough Suffolk wool. Save it up that we have a stack of 10 there. But we need to... We need to remember to save up the yarn. There, now we have all the cloth in our inventory. Right, we can start saving that up in case we need it in the future. Now we'll sell the processed animal products. Harvest the garlic. And the fodder. Oh, so it gives you a certain number of harvests and then it's done. Alright, in this game it's not forever. Good to know. It probably said it in the seed packet, but I missed it. We are a bit late going on our garden tour today, but that's fine. We got a lot done. Let's make some garlic seeds. We can then start growing garlic here too. Yes, I thought so. We have some cucumber seeds here waiting to be sown. There they go. We'll keep that field free for garlic. Yeah, we can so the turnip seeds in our regular garden, or on our farm, I should say. We have some four-star oranges and cherries here. And avocados. They are four-star ones too. Coffee trees. Well... We'll have to wait a bit for those, but it'll be worth it because they will be 10 star coffee trees. We'll be able to make some excellent coffee with those 10 star coffee beans. We can sell the cucumbers. Do we have any cherries? Yes, we do. One star ones. The same with the oranges. We'll replace these and sell the one star cherries and oranges. Avocados. Do we just put them in the fridge or do we make avocado oil out of them? Let's go see. Uh huh. Can't make any oil out of them. At least not with the condiment maker. Let's just put the rest of them into the fridge as well. It's 
sell those. So the turnip seeds, they can go right here. We still have the summer garden to tend to. There's a pineapple harvest here. I think there were some... Were there some melons here? Yes. Waiting to be made into seeds. Let's do the pineapple thing first. And one more. No, actually two more. There. The trees are not harvestable yet, are they? No. No, they're not. Next stop. A sprite village. I think we have enough inventory space for whatever they want to give us. We have seven new followers. Very nice. We can get everybody to 48 followers. And let's go see what they have for us. Whiskered Velvet Shrimp and Giant Freshwater Prawn. Sap and Logs. Rabbit Fur and Fodder. And a level up. At the shop. Nothing really, but... Maybe we could buy one black rose and one lily. I don't remember if we've uh, sold those before or not. If we sell them, then maybe the flower shop will expand its selection. Baked apple and tea, tulip and okra, gold ore and iron ore, and grass. Let's go back home, organize our inventory a little, and then see what we've got time for after that. We have quite a few things we can sell. The uh, shrimp and prawn, logs, flowers, food and okra. We'll want to put the pineapples into the fridge. And do we have a room in here for the yo-yo? We could place this butter maker near the barn with the other milk processing devices. Nothing else.
else we really need from here at the moment or nothing else that can be useful. Let's put the auras away and then go place the butter maker. Now ah, looks like trees have taken over here once again. We need to do a bit of work before we need before we can place the butter maker. And while we're here, may as well clear some more of this area. There, much better visibility. I guess we should clean up here a bit too. Make room for more forage to spawn. The grass goes in there. Improve the visibility around the path. And I guess we could empty this little pond. The museum will be open tomorrow, so we can go there first thing. Just doing some cleaning here, scooping up these puddles, which there are plenty of. Oh, more sugar. And a buttercup. It does look much nicer without puddles everywhere. That's another pond emptied. Once again we'll have quite a few things to identify tomorrow. Not quite as many as we did today, but six in all. Let's make some more bricks. These take so long to make that it'll be nice to have a bit of a stock of them stored away somewhere. Ah, I was wondering when our inventory would get full. We'll put the bricks and ingots away. And now we can go gather up the rubies. We have a stack of 11. Let's keep a stack of like 10 and sell the rest. We can also sell both of these, I think. And that's the shipping bin full. Can't sell the buttercup flower. 
oh well, we'll just have to hang on to it and sell it tomorrow. The pink cats go in there. And the sugar cane goes in here. We'll put the sage into the fridge. And end our walk. And then it looks to be about time for us to call it a day as well and head upstairs. So we'll save here for now and continue on to the next day next time. Thank you so much for watching, liking, commenting and subscribing. All of those things really help this channel a lot. Please remember to be kind to yourself. Have a lovely rest of your day. And I'll see you next time.